Greetings, small folk, and welcome to Small Land. You have just made your first journey into the overworld. Speak to Hearn. He has lots of valuable tips and tricks on how to navigate the overworld. Survival tools are going to be important. A hammer, hatchet and building tool are all vital resources for any small folk making the dangerous journey. Let's collect some resources. Blackberries will really help us with our hunger. Let's slide down this hill. Fibre and wood are both important resources. Resin can be used to build fire-based equipment like arrows and torches. It looks like there's some edible mushrooms here for us. Let's build a hatchet so we can cut these down. By putting the mushroom into our inventory, we can then easily access this to eat at any time. Did you see that? I think there are ants around. It's best we got prepared and crafted ourselves a wooden club It seems the ants snuck up on us. In small lands, you've got to make sure you're aware of all the creatures around you. Speaking of which... One ant was easy, but two poses more of a challenge. Creatures like ants drop valuable resources for you to use in your crafting and cooking recipes. Using our antenna vision, we can get a better look into the overworld and see what resources are available. Fighting isn't always an option. Some creatures can't traverse certain areas. Use the environment to your advantage. This looks like a good place to set up our camp. We're going to need a building hammer in order to craft a campfire and a workbench. Campfires help you stay warm and can be used to cook different foods. Workbenches are important for building structures to create your base. Let's venture out and see what we can find. A soya beetle. This looks like it'll pose more of a challenge than the ants did.
A combination of rolls, blocking and attacks is the only way to face off against something this big. There are many tough creatures in the world of small land. As you progress your skills, you'll be able to fight more and more. This has been a look into the first five minutes of small land. I hope you've enjoyed this, and we'll be back with more updates soon. Until next time, small folk.